Hello, I work to train Symphiatic. In this episode, I'm going to show you how to uh, upload loco images to the eCourse. What I mean by loco images are these images up here. You can change what images you have. If you enter the setting for each loco, You have an option here where about you can choose what image you would like and there's quite a few pre-installed which is fine as long as you have a, a continental layout but one of the nice features with the ecos is it's basically a computer in disguise so you can actually upload new images. You've got to make sure that it's connected to your home network and the first thing you need to do once you're connected to the network is to find out what address it is on your home network. So click on this icon up at the top, the maintenance icon, then you click on the IP setting on the side and then it shows you your IP address. There are different ways of doing this depending on your home network but if you're plugged into a standard uh, router this is the easiest way to do it. So you make a note of your address and then you enter it on your computer. So first thing you need to do is load up your preferred web browser. Then you put in your address from your um, eCourse. So you enter that up at the top and you press enter. Depending on your network setup, sometimes you'll have a fit address like what I have set up, other times it will change each time you use it. So the first screen show you all your basic objects. So you've got your hardware version, software version, this is also where you up, update your software, serial number, MAC address and several other bits. So to upload your image you click, you click on loco image, click on user defined images then you click on this logo here. So you click on that. You choose what category it is. Choose your image. I'm going to go for class 150 as I can never remember which one is which. Stick that there, put the description up there, which is what you call it. Last dash five zero, and then you press submit. Then you go, you keep on doing this. So this will now show on here. The next thing you need to do is to restart your device, which is easy from here. You just click it on this button here and then you just click it just there and that will lock out for software okay on for ecos what we need to do is select the loco which i already have which is for class 150 green click on the spanner click on edit loco then you click on user define images Select that one, press your tick on there, and now it's displaying it. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. 
I might not be uploading a video next week, but I should be back to normal the week after it. It's all depending on how warm it gets. Thank you for your time, Richard.